tonight. As you can tell, it's been fine. So today, we're gonna be trucking more corn. Oh, we got that bin empty. Still got some in this bin here. Um, not much left, a little bit in the sweep. And then uh, we got another bin that's got ready for the sweep. I'm gonna throw that in. And then uh, we'll have all the corn hauled. I'm in the bin. Watch it by myself in there. Well, it appears we have a varmint. Oh, what the heck? Let's see, can you guys see in there? Is he down there? Hello? Are you there? Hello? I don't know. Let's break out the live trap. You almost stole our hammer. Whatever it is, raccoon, woodchuck, probably woodchuck. I hate woodchuck. Well, we're gonna fire up the bin sweep now. This one's for our lug. And our U-trough down below. And this one's uh, a transfer auger. And then this one's going to the bin we're pulling corn from bin five. Then we got our bin fan on too, to uh, keep the dust down. Ignore the mess. It's pretty messy. We'll clean it up before we get busy. To the bin we go! Ready to go. I'm gonna go start the other truck. Get it filled up. Grandpa's Peter built. Grandpa's trailer. 40 footer. Oh there it is. Jesus scared the crap out of me. What? What are you doing? It's got uh look at that right there. You can't probably see that. 41 original miles, 41,000. Man, this thing needs a wax. Bad. Tony from Fastag, he had a video on it. Maybe polish up the tank too. See what we can do. So it's coming out of that bin there. And coming up this auger here. Drops down. Comes through this new drop. And then it goes up that leg. And comes down this downspout here.
driving would be a good time to answer some questions. Uh, one question, the guy asked uh, how cool it is to make friends uh, in the farming community all over the world, and it's really cool, honestly. Uh, I've met so many people uh, in person and online. I guess I haven't met them online, but I talk to people online. Um, I've made so many connections, resources, learned so much information, see how different guys farm, learn new things. I mean, it's unreal the, um, the way that our generation can network and get a hold of people. Uh, I had problems with my uh, with the new planner this uh, past spring, and I was able to get in contact with somebody, and uh, they gave me some tips. Um, I actually have his phone number. If I ever have problems, I give him a call. Um, so that's awesome. But it's just unreal the amount of people you meet, uh, the things you learn, and uh, just nothing but good stuff. You meet some. You meet a few bad ones here and there, for sure. Um, but there's more good than bad. Albion's got a really cool system here. This tag stays hanging on the truck. Uh, you can put it away once you leave, but when you're here, you leave it out, and then that thing right there will scan this card, and then it shows up right here on the screen. Chamber of cash. You can hit continue. Oh, you don't have to every time. Let me just go to the probe. Let's go on tarp. I just scanned our card again and over to your left there on the screen saying that it's grading it's got my weight and then in a second here it's going to tell us if this wants us to go straight ahead or if we're going to go to the right over to the back dump so we're going to the back dump So again, little guy right there scanned us. It's Wayne right now. That says take the ticket. Grab our ticket. And go Dr. Penny on the probably all the trash. I can't remember what BCFM stand for. But probably just the trash. This corn, like I said, it's got a got a lot of crushed corn and fines in it. Nothing we can do about it. Now we're gonna pull ahead up here, park, and then uh, roll up our tarp, and away we will go. Oh, my own tarping service. Automatic tarp. <laughs> Ooh, look at that guy. He's running corn right there. 
there is a combine grain cart going. Do you think uh, this corn might be coming to the ethanol plant? I would, I would assume so, but maybe not. Three hours, uh, about three and a half hours later, I'm just now getting back to the farm. Nobody's here. Ah, Michael is over mowing his lawn. Oh, I don't know how guys uh, truck every day for a living do it because I would be so sick of trucking every day. I would, I would be so bored. But we're pretty much done hauling there to Albion. Maybe one or two more loads. But tomorrow we're gonna hit the beans heavy. Ran some today and they were about 15 to 17. Elevator wasn't open though. So we're gonna hold off until tomorrow. We'll hit her hard tomorrow. And uh, hopefully get at least 100 acres done. Get some of these probably won't get 100 acres actually because we got a couple fields that are half done or parsh some spots missing so we gotta jump around and finish those up but Wednesday we shall hit her hard try and knock out a lot better go make sure my bin lid is closed here on the big bin She's just about empty. She's got just a just a little bit left in the sweep. Maybe not even a half a truckload. But we still got some whole bin that needs to be swept yet. About 3,000 bushel there. We'll sweep that out tomorrow and uh, get that out of here and we'll be ready. Check out this bin ladder. can't even see it. Hold on. Can you see that? No, you can't even see it. Never mind. Is the lid close? No, it's not close. Nice view up here. Yeah. There's Michael mowing his lawn way down there. By the gypsum pile. Well, until tomorrow. Thanks for watching.